I want to share this with you guys. The scenario here is this. The, uh, the boat is on shore power right now. What we're running on the boat is the charger and the fridge is running. And so that draws about 80 watts. But I've just plugged in the big battery, the six hour battery for the lawnmower, which I just cut yesterday. So what's happening now is we're asking for 185 watts. That's the lawnmower battery plus the items on the boat. And the solar panel is producing 146. That, a bit of an annoyance because that, that's a 240 watt panel. And that, this goes back to why I, I recommend you guys get two 100s because um, they just don't yield, right? <clears throat> uh, anyway, back to the subject. The way I'm doing this now is the shore power is going through the Mohs the transfer switch. So what's going to happen is that as soon as the uh, battery drops down to 13, whatever that threshold is, I think 13.3, 13.2, um, Mo's transfer switch is going to cut the boat over to the, uh, what do you call it, over to the house power, right? But the inverter is still going to be, because I've plugged in the battery for the lawnmower directly to the inverter, okay? And so it's going to continue dealing with that load. Uh, the panel will be producing 146. Looks like the battery's asking for about 100, right? If the boat was drawn 80. So it'll be able to handle that at 147 watts. And I'll continue recharging the battery until it's full. Then when I take it off, uh, the battery voltage will start to increase, right? Because um, we won't have the loader anymore. Mo's will keep the boat on shore power, on, on house power, until the battery level comes back up. And then the Mohs transfer switch will cut the whole thing back over to the inverter. It's working perfect. It is flawless. And by plugging some items directly into the inverter, like this battery charger, um, they get to run constantly on sun power to do with it. And then uh, loads that can't be sustained are automatically transferred over to the Mohs switch. Hopefully this is not confusing. I'm really uh, loving this. I hope you guys understand it. And uh, it's working great. This Mohs transfer switch is uh, amazing. Great addition.